Hello everybody, this is Terry Jeanette with The Tapping Flamingo. Today's video is all about the creations that I made with the Bargain Beadbox August 2021 Wildflower Meadow. So everything was so gorgeous this month and I still have a boatload of beads and things left over to create more. But I wanted to go ahead and show you all the things I've been working on. One of them is what I have on right here. But let me take you on a closer tour of it. So when I first opened this, I envisioned it on a piece of black cording or something like that. Well, I didn't have any black cording. In fact, the only cording I had was actually too big to fit through the bale. So I decided, instead of just hanging it out on a chain, to beat it up in a very simple way. And I took the green, uh, the grass green bicone beads and the lavender quartz beads and just beaded it up until I ran out of the lavender beads. <laughs> I had one left, <laughs> and um, but I also used them in a different piece, so... There were quite a few of them. But then I just finished it off with a chain and a lobster claw clasp. And as you saw, it's a very tiny, simple piece. The next thing I want to show you that I made is this thing. And again, when I unboxed this, I envisioned it very simple, just on a, a chain. But, you know, we have to be a little bit more creative than that. So I made this very simple piece with the links and those really pretty crystals that they have. I um, forgot what color they were. To me, they're almost like a ballet pink, which is the same color as the flower that's in there. And then I just made um, a pair of earrings that go nicely with it. In fact, I've made three pair of earrings, and they all would go really nicely with it. I'll go ahead and show them to you. I've got these. Just depends if you want to highlight the green or the pink. So with these, I just used the um, the links, and I hung the leaf at the bottom here. I, I wish the holes in these leaves were a little bit bigger. I had issues trying to find something to hang them with. I did another pair of earrings and another video. This the bargain bead mashup, uh, maker mashup. And I wanted them, wanted the earrings I made to hang like that, but I couldn't get them to do it. They turned out fine. I like them, but it's really not what I had envisioned. These are the only jump rings I had to be able to fit through these that weren't too wimpy. But let me show you the other pair of earrings I made. And again, I hung the uh, leaf off of them. And there's a lot of movement to this. <laughs> so the leaves do move around quite a bit. But you can just move them back into place and hang them in your ears. And they will be fine. The last thing I want to show you today is this bracelet. I love this bracelet and I mixed my metals. I have the silver bead caps that I used with these uh, lavender quartz beads. I think they're calling them quartz beads. Let me make sure. Yes, they were lilac quartz dyed. But um, I like the antique brass and the silver together. And especially with these old world looking beads. I absolutely love this. I'm going to list all of these in my Etsy shop. I really want to keep them all. I really like this bracelet, but I can't do that. <laughs> I just can't keep everything, but these turned out really, really nicely. And let me show you, I still have quite a few things to create with left. I still have all of these petals, which I I envision this in a um, flower, like an actual flower. I believe it was uh, orchid and opal. I'll, I'll make sure about that and um, leave a link so you can go check her unboxing out. But when she was unboxing, or not when she was unboxing, 
when she actually was creating, she created this beautiful brooch. And it was really kind of funny because in my unboxing, I hadn't seen her video yet, I envisioned these petals into a flower, but I really don't know how to do it. And hopefully she's going to do a tutorial. I'm excited about that. But anyway, we still have a lot of bead caps, the daisy beads, these fun moonstone beads, and got all kinds of things, and I'm sure I'm going to be creating some more. I will have at least one more video coming out on the 22nd with the Bargain Bead Box Maker Mash Up. Um, I made a couple of items for that, so look for that in the future. And I will definitely have to be making some more. But in the meantime, out of these creations, which one do you like the best? I think I like the bracelet the best. Although, I love them all. I love everything about this box this month. Anyway, I hope that you give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already and you're looking to learn more about jewelry making, subscribe to my channel and ding the bell for notification. Mostly, though, I hope you all have a fantastically wonderful day. This is Terry Jeanette with the Tapping Flamingo signing out for now. Bye-bye.